PNG politics known for its own unwritten rules. But party coalition traditions the same as any Westminster government system. Party promises and ministerial portfolios distributed to members of parliament that represents the coalition ties in government. System to the fact that uh, to find party balance there needs to be a distribution of ministry that respects uh, one ministry to be allocated to three ministers per party uh, ministry sharing ratio. Uh, these two fine gentlemen had to vacate their spot in cabinet that made way for the ascension of the member for Namatanai. However, the longest serving politician in PNG politics not taking it lightly, referring to the recent minor reshuffle which saw a member of his party lose a portfolio. To lose a ministry to a junior uh, officer, the, uh, the politician, I, I just cannot equate justification on that. So, yes, I am disappointed because we were promised that we would keep three ministries, we lost two. We lost Mr. Isifo at the time of transition, and now we lost uh, Mr. Tamo for doing nothing wrong. The replacement of Tourism Minister Emil Tamur with National Alliance member Walter Schnobelt bringing up existing party rivalries in the New Guinea Islands region between PPP and National Alliance. So we are solidly part of this government. But the recent action by the Prime Minister to demote the PPP for whatever reason, I don't know, but it's very clear uh, someone is out to kill PPP, and particularly in New Island. I welcome the fact that we are in very small province and have two ministers, you know, but uh, what is the reason behind it? I will leave that to, for you to guess. Except for Governor Sir Julius, both tourism and treasury ministers are New Island MPs representing KBN and Amatanai Open Seat, and both are members of the National Alliance Party. Firstly, I would like to thank the Marape Basel government for the trust they have in National Alliance Party and in appointing me as one of the MPs within the party uh, this new portfolio. And uh, I'm sure being so close to me back in New Island province, um, <laughs> um, I'm going to hear a lot from you on some of the um, uh, fiscal requirements. Uh, and I can see, um, I can see I'm going to be under some, some pressures in, in coming weeks. Now both the ministers, after Emil Tamur, a member of PPP, was removed, causing Sir Julius to question coalition ties. As he says, the minority parties played a huge role when the government changed hands last year. Because one vote counted at that time, a year ago, and it was PPP that played a pivotal role in convincing the then Prime Minister that in the interest of good governance and stability of the country that probably it would have been best for him to step aside, which he did. Now, how do you equate that with a three-to-one ratio? We have contacted Prime Minister James Marbot to comment on Sergei's concern and we are yet to receive a response. Adelaide Sorokskari, National, MTV News.